another question on the YouTube by Mujahid Hussein Khan. Assalamu alaikum, wa alaikum salam. My question is, I work in an electrical company in USA. I am an electrical engineer by profession. Is it permissible for me to work over there? What if the company is dealing in riba? The question posed by the brother is working, he is an electrician and he is an electrical engineer and he is working for an electrical company. He is asking the question, what if that company is dealing in riba? Is it permitted to work for that company? First, let us understand that generally the company you are working for, you have to try and find out that what is the core activity of that company. If the core activity of the company is electrical appliances or electrical goods, buying and selling or doing electrical applications or uh, uh, going into apartments or offices and taking care of the electrical uh, aspects, the core activity is halal. Even if the company has an account which is riba based, you are not involved with that. And even if they get riba every month, that riba will be a small percentage. So if you are working for a company in which the haram activity is very small, like they have an account in the bank and they are getting interest, but the net profit of the company is because of doing a haram activity. For example, an electrical company, the main activity is halal. Even if they have a small portion of haram income, like keeping an account in a riba based bank, conventional bank and getting them interest, you have to consider that your salary is coming from the halal work. If the major portion of your company is haram, for example electrical company, but they have got so much of money in the fixed deposit and the major income or quite a large portion, maybe 25% of the income is from interest, then that's another question. If a major portion or a substantial portion of that income is coming from a haram source, whether they are selling alcohol or whether it is riba based, then working is not permitted. But if a minor portion, 2%, 3%, 5%, 10% is from a haram income, as long as you are not involved in that haram activity. If you are involved in the haram activity, then it is haram for you to work. But you are working as an electrical engineer and your work is halal and at the same time the company is doing some haram activity and you are not involved in that haram activity, think that the salary you are getting is from the halal income of that company. Hope that answers the question.